Hi, this is Daytime at 9. I'm Miriam Martinez. I'm with the president of IMS, Ms. Julie Johnson. Welcome. Hi, how are you today? I'm really excited to visit with you. It was an exciting 2015. I would love for us to show a little bit about the recap 2015, but the upcoming season for 2016, I hear there's a lot of action going to happen here. You bet. So in 2015, we had three science exhibits. Uh, Kids' Struction was our first one. Then we went into space and we explored all different types of uh, man, uh, man space flight. And then this fall, we've had electricity exhibit. We also did over 12 different artists that came in um, this past year. And from everything from photographs, by a blind photographer to the um, totem poles out front to our um, artist in residence, Ran Wong. She did a string art exhibit in our gallery, in the art gallery. And we've had everything else in, in between. Um, so 2015 was great, um, but 2016 is going to be awesome. So tell us more about 2016. I want to mention very briefly that I was at an event here and I was blown away by the coordination, by the beauty and the presence. So you can do a lot of events here at IMS and it's phenomenal. The staff is amazing Thank you. and it, was, it felt really warm and different and unique. So I want to congratulate you okay. because of those events are so needed here in the Valley and a lot of people don't know that you can do your event here at IMS. We do all types of different events here. So we do everything from weddings, in fact, we're having one here this weekend, to birthday parties, the special events like you went to, book signings, um, musical events, all different types of things. And we also work with a, a variety of organizations like the Consulate of Mexico um, and all the other different um, uh, organizations throughout the Valley. So now the time has come to find out what's going to be happening for 2016. So in 2016, we have some great events coming up. So in January, we have three new exhibits opening. Um, one is called Eat Well, Play Well. It's all about healthy living and healthy lifestyles, pre-K all the way up. And then we have Brain Teasers 2, which is if you are mathematically inclined or you love to solve puzzles, that one's for you. And then we have an indoor sculpture to go along with our outdoor sculptures of George Tabalowski. He's going to be bringing in 30 of his sculptures from Dallas, so we're very excited about that. But in May, we have the first time ever in the United States an exhibit coming in from Taiwan. It's all about the indigenous weave or textiles of the people of Taiwan. First time ever here. And we're super excited. That's going to be so beautiful because it's, it's an art within itself and it's something that you can wear. So you, you can come and learn. I love the bugs here. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> I, I've named one Lupita, actually. I oh, thought okay. it was a he, but it was a she. <laughs> and, and we're getting along quite well. Is there any exhibitions coming up with bugs? You bet. We have a huge 6,000 square foot animatronic bug exhibit. So the bugs are larger than life. Some of them are going to be 18 feet high, 12 feet long, and you get to go through and see and be the bug beside the bug, right? That's going to be phenomenal. On your screen, you can find the address, the phone number, Facebook. But if you want to have a special event, come on by because it's amazing. I want to congratulate you and thank you for being a part of Daytime at 9 and wishing you happy holidays, happy new year and to your wonderful staff. They are amazing. So thank you so much. This is Daytime at 9. Happy holidays everybody.